everyone and a good evening to you. Gorgeous sunset across the area. We're seeing those high clouds, which always makes for a gorgeous sunrise or sunset. And in this case, we got a gorgeous sunset. Temperatures right around 60 degrees after topping out in the low to mid 60s. And don't forget daylight saving ends at 2 a.m. So 159, 2 o'clock strikes, we go right back to 1 a.m. So at least we get the extra hour of sleep, but don't forget to test your smoke alarms. And now is a good time to also check your weather radios if you do have that change the batteries, all of that as well. Also keep in mind sunsets an hour earlier. So our new sunrise at 621, new sunset at 5:15 p.m. So we'll see that extra hour of sleep, which is nice and temperatures in the 50s and 60s. And then going forward, you can see just some passing high clouds in the sky. We're staying dry, high pressure and full force. That's going to drive our weather over the next several days, and that's going to keep us dry, keep us clear, mostly clear. But we'll start to see an increase in moisture as that high pressure begins to track more to the east. So over the next 12 hours, again, if you're going to be out and about this evening, bundle up. Temperatures will still be in the 40s and then overnight will fall into the low to mid 40s. Some areas may try and drop into the upper 30s, but with an earlier sun rise, we won't really have all that much time. Future cast just letting it roll on through into our Sunday. We're expecting mostly sunny skies, kind of similar to today. And then in Monday morning, we'll see partly cl uh, cloudy skies. So an increase in moisture as that high pressure begins to track more to the east. And even going into our Tuesday, we're going to stay dry, but you'll notice it will be warmer and it will be more humid as well. So your weather headlines, it's going to be beautiful. Go out and enjoy it, but we'll see more clouds and moisture by Monday before another cold front moves through. So temperatures are going to start to uh, warm up before cooling back down. Here's our chance for rain over the next few days. We stay dry until Wednesday, but even then mostly dry 20%. Here comes that cold front Thursday into Friday with a 40% chance for rain that may go up over the next few days. But again, so will these temperatures in the mid 60s and then eventually mid 70s. But still that's close to normal this time of year. This time of year we should be around 76. So we're just trending right below that and then temperatures will be right back into the lower 60s. So if you're enjoying this cooler weather, it will come back even when we warm back on up. So if you are going to be out and about, as I mentioned, temperatures will be chilly in the 40s and then we fall back at 2 a.m. Don't forget about that sunrise 621 in the morning. So overall, very, very nice. And tonight will fall into the 40s, as I mentioned, low to mid 40s. And then tomorrow still going to be a beautiful day, low to mid 60s, around 63 degrees. And keep in mind, sunset at 515. If you do miss out, on our weather forecast on here, you could always find us at, on the radio and we'll have the same forecast there as well. We've got you covered there. So looking at the seven day overall, very nice weather pattern over overnight temperatures will gradually begin to warm back up into the 50s. Here comes that front and then looking ahead to next weekend, it's going to be beautiful temperatures in the lower 60s. Overnight will fall right back on down into the 40s. We'll have more coming up. Stay with us.